Hey Best Pally, I'm Allie, and over the years I've transformed my apartment to a funhouse immersive artwork. Let's take a look at some of the extra outrageous things I've done so far. I can fill a wall. I can fill a wall. I can fill a wall. That is crazy! <laughs> Does my yard need a tiny little grill? <sighs> yep. In a conference room. How awesome! What is this? I'm drinking out of this river of beer in my apartment. A red carpet entrance. Oh, hello! Superstar! Holy crap! I can't believe that worked. First up, we have the epic 3,200 pop socket wall. This is super satisfying. So I wanna do that a whole lot more. I've done enough damage to my couch, my car, and my bike. I should probably find a different victim. So I'm thinking coffee table. What do you think, table? You wanna become a giant fidget toy? Completely covering you in pop sockets should make you pretty outrageous. But also like kinda useless. I mean, useless in the sense that You'll be pretty bad at being a table, but you'll be very good at being a giant weird kinetic sculpture thing. Now let's just see how much my bulk dreams are gonna cost. It turns out just 3,136 tiny little pieces of plastic, that's all I need. This is a stupid idea, which is exactly why I should still do it. Hey, okay, I've placed my bulk order and the style is mixed colors, so that's very exciting. Yes, look what just popped up on my doorstep. I mean, socked up on my doorstep. So excited to see my thousands of babies. What the heck? Did they send me all browns? Come on. Okay, there are more. There are just browns on top. There are plenty of colorful things happening here. Now that's freaking cool. Here's every color. Now I just gotta figure out how I want the design to be and why doesn't it seem like these are significantly way bigger than what I based my pattern on. Turns out I used the diameter of their mini version. So now I have entirely too many sockets, which sounds like a problem a robot would have. 57 square feet. What's that, like eight by seven? Eight by seven. I could fill a wall. I could fill a wall. I could fill a wall. I could cover a floor to ceiling to here. Wall. Now I want to design what I'm going to do with these colors. Got my one foot pattern and then this is the size of the wall. Place these all along. That's how it'll look all red. Thinner stripes. Okay, wait, I think I like sloppy. This makes sense of the colors. It looks like one of those sand bottles that you fill as a kid and see the design and of course you pick every color option that they have in the whole thing. What if it gets shaken up? Because you know that's going to happen. That's cool. I like this a lot. Let's go make a wall weird. <laughs> I have a terrible idea. Making a socket angel is something that I've never known that I always wanted. <laughs> that is art. I should just give up. This is it. We're done. The first one. Here we go. I don't know why I'm nervous. Placed and it works. Oh, I'm already so psyched. <laughs> Just 3,199 to go. Oh, putting on the first red one. Eee. I'm just winging it on how these are gonna fade into each other. And also winging it on the spacing. I'm guessing at all of this. Finishing up with blue and transitioning into the green, which is the color of a sacamole. arrived at brown and I'm actually not as mad at it anymore. Look, I'm covering up this nasty hole in the wall. I'm sure my landlord will love that. Oh my goodness, I am so close. Also, I should maybe have Googled sooner how to remove pop sockets. <laughs> sock sock, who's there? Not my security deposit. And the final pop placement. And <gasps> it is done. It is done. Done, and it is gorgeous and kind of pointless. No, it is very useful. I can do this and this. Oh, wow, this feels great. And I have only done the popping. I haven't even got to the socketing part yet, ready? Oh my God. <laughs> Wait, now I kind of want to do a bunch with my butt. Yep, best thing ever. It's also a completely impractical message board. Touch me. Thank you, Art. Don't mind if I do. It's really cool playing with the different depths. And Paul Smith, I'm coming for your title of most Instagrammable wall. Now the question is, should I unpop all 3,200 of them at once? Which really is the question, how long will it take me to obviously do that? And the answer is, 
Precisely one hour, three minutes, and two seconds. It's done, and they are all prepared to be socked down. Though I feel like I should probably share this outrageousness. While I wait, let me just show you. I figured out that you can do it with one finger. Oh my god. This may be the end of my life. I'm nervous, and I want you're crazy. Just look. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa. Oh my goodness. <laughs> How did you even come up with this? <laughs> Who does this with pop sockets? Wait, wait, wait. I did, I pulled them yeah. all out so we can do it all oh, at once. Let's oh, do it all together. of them. Yeah. I'm really stressed out today. <laughs> Not anymore. Okay, let's go. I want to put my face in it. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you gotta try butt. Well, that's my favorite. Squats on the wall. <gasps> Last one. <laughs> sure, fidgeting is great, but I also enjoy just relaxing in my yard. What? <laughs> <laughs> what is this? I feel like I should be the person that just has an outrageous indoor yard room. Oh yeah, and why my kitchen? And it's the least inviting room in my apartment, so I'm not gonna fight that. I'll just make it more inviting. Home improvement store. Although I probably need the opposite of home improvement. Where's the place where I can make my house like weirder? They're growing my future yard. It's going to be flimsy because I'm getting the crappiest kind. <laughs> can I help? I hope someday I don't have to be outrageous on a budget, but until then, I just have to put in a little extra effort. Here's the fake that I need. It almost costs as much as my lawn. <laughs> Might have to order online. Ooh, do I need a mower for upkeep? Does my yard need a tiny little grill to sit next to my stove indoors? A couple of these would be really cool, but they're solar powered, so they'd never turn on. I'll deal with you in a bit. Just uh, finding a park online. I'll show you the stuff I'm getting as it arrives, but I did want to point out, I was looking for a stool that I could use for maybe a table because they're small. And uh, it offered me this instead, which I'm not mad about because I, I definitely need that for my lawn. Empty protein containers. Why do I save these? So I'm like, oh, maybe I'll use them for a video sometime. Just sweeping up so there'll be no dirt underneath my grass. Now for the extra fun part, growing the lawn. <laughs> okay. It's already looking awesome. Now for the cutting part. Okay, yeah, this stuff is flimsy enough. I can definitely use scissors. Perfect. I'm not wanting to go barefoot on this. So man, lawn care is a lot of work. I'm sweating. Just throw this back there perfectly. Let's take a look, shall we? Let's get it! Ah. <laughs> My kitchen is grass. My kitchen is grass. It's like 10 times better and I haven't even added anything else yet. One of the things just showed up already today. Oh my goodness. Just fine, or I can connect this to a pipe. There we go. And I should get my lights going as soon as the uh, sun sets, I'll need these. Ooh, and Lauren Powell gave me this for a couple of past videos. This is definitely fake outdoors. Planted! The rest of my park is here! <clears throat> I realize there are still two things that should arrive at the end of the day today, and they happen to be my two favorite additions, so turns out I got lucky with the climax thing. I'm gonna get all this set up and then we can have the two best parts left. Get my white picket pens ready. It has three little inserts, which I feel like need to be filled by some Bushes. Fantastic landscaping on my part. These are exact spheres. Now to add some moss rock landscaping to the new surface. Where'd they go? They're hiding. These might look real, but no, they're super fake. Don't worry. I think there are some other horizontal surfaces that need grass in here. Like right along here. Wait, do I have an actual living plant? Get out of here. Sweet. And maybe some heavy rocks to hold it down. Yeah. This stuff is like so messy. Need a leaf blower in here. And obviously the thing I use most in here needs some love. Yay! I hope the microwaves don't turn it brown. And this awesome addition, it's functional and fashionable. Obviously when we're hanging out drinking, we need a stump to put our drinks on. As expected, the last box is here. Who could have a yard without pink flamingos? This guy can't live. The final edition, an activity for my lawn. An old kitchen activity 
Sure. Oh! Yeah! Let's just check out the whole thing in a sweeping glamour shot, shall we? And now to go appreciate the great outdoors. This is how nature intended. <sighs> Honestly, it really is just relaxing being out in the wild. I really want to get down and appreciate that. <sighs> yep, the freshly mowed lawn smell. What? <laughs> what is this? Oh my god. You did this all by yourself? I did. This makes perfect sense. I mean, why wouldn't you? It's great. <laughs> I'm already utilizing the wood stem. You have a lot of free time. Hey. This is so ridiculous. This dude needs a name. Let's cut thing. a hole in him and drink out of him. And then when I pick a fence, of course. <laughs> We're like, why? This is absolutely ridiculous. You have to go pee pee? No, don't say pee pee. <laughs> you have to go pee pee? No, stop it. Oh, look at her face. No. Why are you encouraging this? <laughs> Isn't it better than it was, though? The color scheme is so perfect, it's creepy. You know what I mean? <laughs> No, this is making me nervous. She's entirely too sniffy. You're a big fan, huh? Tell them how much you love it. Okay. Yeah! I think the exact opposite of going outside would be hanging in the conference room I created. What the fuck? What the fuck? I have this weird hallway, small, like tiny room thing in my apartment. It's kind of hard to show. There's my bedroom, another bedroom, bathroom. But you can shut all the doors, and now I'm in this like weird space that's echoey and small, but kind of inviting. So I think this space could be more inviting, and I want to make it so. Like, you're in a tiny room that's hugging you. Like, wall-to-wall -wall cozy. Okay, I'm looking for fur, but a very specific functioning type of fur that moves and looks in a very specific way. I got what I need, and it's a lot. It's a whole lot. All right. Okay, I chose this fur because, well, one, it's gorgeous. And two, it looks different depending upon which direction you brush it. Now, why is that important? Because that means you can write stuff in it. Hi, Pally. <laughs> this is already great, except I have a whole lot of work ahead of me. Okay, this is gonna be forever fur. How this is gonna, oh yeah. That should hold up, right? I feel like all of my Living Outrageous videos are me being like, this is probably gonna work. I know I already calculated this, but I'm measuring again just to be sure. You know, measure five billion times, cut once. According to my calculations, I should start in that corner to make it easiest to deal with the doors. Also, I don't own a step stool, so. I'm gonna make sure I hang it. Yeah, so it's draping the right way. Okay. Ooh, this is heavy. <sighs> No idea how far apart to put these. <laughs> Don't try this at home, kids. <sighs> this is a workout. Is it actually working? Did I do it? This is making a mess. Yikes. Okay, now this has gotta go on the door. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Just cut a little X in this side. So now, <laughs> that is one panel done. <laughs> and there are five more to go. Ooh, door number two is looking good. It's already starting to feel awesome in here. Although, that and vacuuming does not feel too awesome. What do you think of all the furs? You mad that there's something fuzzier than you here now? I don't know. Which one do I prefer, huh? Prefer? Uh, uh, he thinks I'm funny. Why am I cutting another panel? Do you think I wasn't gonna do the ceiling? You're not a new pally. You knew I was gonna do the ceiling. <laughs> yes. Ooh, where's my hammer? Can't see what I'm doing under here, but it's it's arting. That was a guess. Up. Oh, nope. Didn't hold. Dying again. Uh, Shake with all my might. Ah, oh, that went in. Yep. I got it. It's in. It's in. Staple number two, please. Oh. Oh, it's holding. I think it's holding. <sighs> Oh, that is a struggle. Oh, please stay up. Check this out. It is working. Wow. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm too happy right now. This is, this is a lot. Oh my. It's almost like I don't need to do the floor. The final staple. 
It's in. Okay, now we need the finishing touch. The floor. Let's just fill out all three dimensions. Check out my finished farage. You know, instead of garage. <laughs> Fine, my conference room. Huh? Step into my office. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so I've got the shoes off and every door shut. <gasps> completely surrounded by fur. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. Holy crap. Oh, how awesome. Let's give you a little POV. This is what it's like <laughs> from my view right now. <sighs> Furry. Oh, it feels so crazy in here. Cause it's so quiet, it, the fur's just sucking up all the sound, and it's so cozy, I'm in a hug. This is one of the craziest sensations, and it's in my home. Oh, it's so satisfying that every inch is covered, and all the seams coming together. I almost forgot, I'm also in a message board. <gasps> Let's write some stuff. I don't think I actually needed to label it as such, but my fur haul is outrageous. What the fuck? Ew, it's like on the ground! Oh my god. Very weird. This is what? Like, do I sleep in here? Good night. <laughs> well, probably never leaving right here ever again. Great. I bet you could guess, holidays in my apartment are also outrageous. Today we're gonna make a river of beer in my apartment. Yeah, we <laughs> are. <gasps> Let's go. This needs to be like big enough to like drink out of, like scoop beer right. out of, or float, float a pong ball. I'm using this as a, what is it called? Rolling pin. The rolling pen. pencil. The problem here is that it needs to be food safe and waterproof, which proved to be difficult. We found some putty that we're gonna have to go buy. We found a bridge. That's it. And I think our bank needs grass. It's gonna be like a realistic river that we will drink beer out. <laughs> Buying my river. He just asked if we were teachers. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of it. Yeah, there's a class in stupidity. He gave us the teacher discount. <laughs> that was awesome. I guess we look trustworthy. Yeah, yeah, totally. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We've decided living room is how we're gonna do it. It's gonna start under my couch meander this away here's all our supplies by the way and then boom right there into before the kitchen we're gonna cut the paper after we're done all right so then the bottom needs like a riverbed just to sort of give it some stability this is gonna be hard when it's done so it's not moving. It's not going anywhere. I can't relocate this. It's going to live in my living room. We've got a new system. We found our strengths. I'm good at being a bottom. <laughs> okay. She's the riverbed and I am the walls. The banks. It's coming along. I'm pleased. On to bucket three. Oh yeah. <laughs> No, am I a DIY channel? Am I a satisfying video channel? Am I a drinking channel? We're not drunk, we're plastered. <laughs> no. It smells like, oh no, we bought living moss. <laughs> no. Look at this masterpiece. Bridge placement is now the time. Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god, it looks so good. Animal time? Obviously the island needs something, yeah? Gator probably hangs out by the dual split river situation. Yep. Air Island. <laughs> Eagle on the bridge. <laughs> Here's the stressful part. We gotta add in the golden river bed now to make it food safe and it sets in 20 minutes. Welcome to my river. It's dope. We gotta mix these two together and make it putty and then we're gonna lay that on the inside. So it'll also be like a golden river to complement the beer. Although we're making grain beer because of St. Patty's Day. Look, I don't know. It's made of gold. <gasps> Oh no. Yeah, okay. Really roll it out. Go, go, go. Really? We have three minutes. This is it. Really in the middle. Ah. Oh my god. So much anxiety. Okay, okay. Let's go. Yes, it's perfect. Oh no, we got a hole. Patch in the hole. How? Do, it's not actually setting that fast. No, wait, maybe it's set. So another third, another third. We're cutting it close. Okay. I think it's actually working. It's working. It's the hat. <gasps> it's the hat! You're getting so good at this. Really turning out well, actually. Well, I don't know about that. Oops. <laughs> it's the moose's fault. What did you do? 
<laughs> oh my goodness. What the hell? <laughs> Hours of work. <laughs> so worth it. Oh my god. I'm now a beer and a half in. Was that slurred? A beer and a half in. I'm, my brain's working. You just need to get every angle because the first pour is the pour. I'm super nervous because there's so many ways this could go wrong. If there's any pinpoint hole along this entire track, we're screwed. What if the alligator doesn't like beer? <gasps> Do a countdown. So nervous and so excited. No, you're the counting down. I'm just gonna go one at a time, which I don't know what time is. How many beers does it take to fill a river? Wanna take bets? I'm gonna go with. Three. Ooh, that's a lot. How long do you think? No, I'm going four. Four. Three. Three. Two. Okay. One. Go. Oh, I'm gonna go five. I'm gonna go seven. It's going. It's flowing. <laughs> hurry up, add more. Oh, hurry, oh, hurry for the hurry. Open another one quickly. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. I'm just like cranking them out. What just crank them out. Carpet? Look at it go. We're not even near the end. It might be six, seven, eight. We're gonna have a beer. Oh my god, we have to drink all this. I can't what? leave it in the river. <laughs> wow, it looks like I barely poured anything in here. It hasn't hit the end yet. <gasps> here we go. Oh, it hit the end. This looks awesome. All right, well, it is starting to rise back here, but slowly pour the five. This is six. Okay. No, nope, is it spraying everywhere? Oh, it's getting in my car. Is it our nightmare? Is it holding up? It's holding up. This is the great part. This, this is, is the a, moment of truth. Me, every part of this has been the great part. Yeah. Setting the bridge, yeah, doing like the gotcha. boss. <laughs> Whatever the hell the yellow stuff is. Where's my hat? What is happening? We can't do the green yet. It's too close to the edge here. It's too close to call. This is working. I'm drinking out of this river of beer in my apartment. This is ridiculous. I'm not even making a dent. This is gold. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. Pour more beer in. We're going seven beers now. Go, go. It's like a lava lamp of alcohol on my floor, and you're drinking out of it. Let's make it even better. Happy St. Patrick's Day, everyone. <laughs> Let me just get down in my river. I caught me lucky charm. I'm missing out. That's fine. I can't wait to have people over to enjoy my river. Anyone that comes over to drink out of my beer river deserves a red carpet entrance. Welcome, sir! <laughs> what is this? Generally, I want to make people feel special. So I'm going to make a glamorous step and repeat with velvet ropes and a red carpet, and I'm gonna do it right behind my front door, so when you enter, it's like you're the lead actor in your own movie being celebrated at your own premiere that you didn't know you were attending. Obviously, the first stop is Home Depot. Sweet. Bye. Hmm, okay. Got it from the vault, thank you. Okay. Okay. I have been saving these protein buckets, thinking I am gonna do something with these, or I'm an idiot. And it turns out I'm both. Oh, that's a cool sound. Just taking some problem solving. I think this is gonna do it. Eh? Uh, it's not gonna work. Huh, this is what I needed. How did that, was that editing? Anyway. Totally using pipes for their intended purpose. Okay. Oh, it worked! Now I still have the problem of attaching the protein tub to the bottom, but I think I can make it work by drilling holes in to add screws to anchor it. And I did make it work, and it looks like crap! Ugh, just let my fail sit and stare at me while I continue to experiment with... What? Oh, this is different plastic! Wait, oh, this brand is way better! Look, it's just... Is this working? I don't... I didn't even glue this. That's dope! Okay, soldiers, time to unhookify you. Sweet! And these caps are looking great. Oh, I'm like a tiny little captain hook. Arr. Now, I feel like something's missing. Oh, they have to be gold. Ooh, elegant. So opulent. Really brings out the PVC logo. While that's drying, I gotta pick up some more luxurious material. Yes, darling. Now I don't really know what I'm doing, but I'm convinced a hot glue gun can make any dream come true. How long do I want it to be? That looks like the perfect amount of drink. This is extremely satisfying. I think we got it. This looks great. Except I wanted a red velvet rope, not a black nylon rope. Oh, okay. See, going. That's 
Fine. Actually, that's really good. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Ah, it's perfect. Now I just gotta step and repeat it. All right. <laughs> Let's see how this looks. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is awesome. Yes. Oh, would you like to play my drums? I'm sorry. That area is VIP. Now it's time to paint the logos. I'm not gonna wing it. Obviously, I want to execute my dumb ideas with the highest quality. Starting with my outrageous logo. What's up? Dope, right? I have another logo. This is my original one from my music. Yep, there we go. I think that's it. The only reason I'm hesitant is because now I gotta put a big gray block on my wall. This is kind of what it'll look like when I'm done. Yes. That is what I want in my house. This is a pretty dramatic color. We are going for it. Okay, here goes nothing. Oh. Ugh. I delicately edged around this ugly brown thing, but screw this. I'm just gonna make it an ugly gray thing. Well, that is very bold. Just gotta let this dry. I think it's already looking great. Now it's time for the logos. Now to step and repeatedly trace these onto the wall. I don't have transfer paper, nor do I want to pay for transfer paper. I have gym chalk, which uh, I think I can make this work. Now again, I'm only guessing that this will work, which is basically every one of my living outrageous videos. I think that I can make things happen and then we see if I can. But hopefully I should be able to put this here and trace it on. Let's see, I'm gonna start with the dead center. Is there a line? On the other side it is! Yes, this is gonna work! Now all I have to do is trace every single line on this and then do that 14 more times. And now for the reveal. There we go. I got the perfect proportions to precision paint. Splendid. My perfectionism only took two hours. Shock and roll. Chuck, Chuck, who's there? Okay, I gotta go paint. Again, I find myself saying I hope this works. I'm just using acrylics. Oh yeah, this is gonna be just fine. Except for the fact that it will take forever. It'll look really good. There we go. See, I paint messing around. The branded backdrop is done! Look, they're stepping, they're repeating. Now let's get those stanchions up. Yes, yes, yes. I'm very excited to see this all together. Oh, yes. Uh-huh. Yeah. Great. Still missing something. You know, I should probably get the finest, cheapest red carpet bath mat that I can find online. Huh. Oh, I thought about it and then... Huh, there it is! Got a ceremony here. Roll this on out. Uh, oh, hello. <laughs> Stop, you're too kind. Oh, this old thing? <laughs> yes, it was designed exclusively for me. No, that's not paint on my leg. Always err on the side of too formal, I always say. And I even feel glamorous when I look like garbage. I think he's here. The man of the hour. Welcome, <laughs> sir! <laughs> Congratulations on your premiere or uh, nomination. Oh, or, uh, oh my god, I thought it wasn't on the list. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, superstar. Welcome to your premiere or nomination or whatever. Paparazzi's going nuts. This is uh, the celebrity treatment, which is what I usually get here, but uh, also the paparazzi has gone home at this point, yeah, so I don't know why. I, uh, there you go. <laughs> When I said holidays earlier, were you thinking Christmas? Yeah, we've done that too. My place has a bunk bed, and an eight foot bear, and a conference room, a wall of kinetic art, a red carpet entrance, a gold skeleton, a digital mom, a yard, whatever this is. Well, can you believe that I don't own a single holiday decoration? What? It's like I don't value standard traditional things. Well, that ends today. I am growing up and getting a normal Christmas tree like a normal person. A significant percentage of my cupboards are dedicated to empty bottles. Now I just need to turn this into holiday cheer. I took an inventory based on size because if I'm making this tree shape, I'm gonna stack them so that all the little ones are on top, all the way down to the big ones at the bottom. Wait, the bottom cupboard. And I found some more. This is helpful because they're bigger and I need to build a solid base. No, 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 no. Chill out. Okay, I'm thinking I might epoxy these together or zip tie. That would maybe be easy or impossible. What I really like is when I have a bunch of the same ones. Like if I had hundreds of these, I could just stack them into a huge cone and it would look awesome. But having a ton of one thing is like almost too easy. The challenge here is that they're all different sizes and I probably don't even have enough now that I'm looking at it. I'm imagining when I first started that it would be 
taller than me. Like, could this be floating up here? Floating. Ooh, I might have an idea. This just got a whole lot harder. No, this just got a whole lot cooler. Dumber? Just keep going, Specs. I was gonna paint it after it was all glued together, but now I think you gotta do that now. Okay, what's really gonna make this convincingly a tree is if I make it all green. Greener. Greenest! But first I gotta make them all the whitest. After two more coats, I'm feeling a little better. The cool thing about spray paint is that it can make everything look like it's made out of the same material, which is gonna go a long way in making this work. I'd like to point out that these almonds have a sell-by date of August 2016, so that means this is at least a five-year collection of garbage. It is so satisfying watching them turn from white to green. This is the amount of weight I need to hold up. Okay, I need a grid. Mm, smaller or... Of course, we're going bigger. Well, this happened, trying to film myself riding. I had this whole thing in my head with the bandana and the hi-ho, outrageous! Nope. Seriously, I need a film crew already. Just quickly Googling how to tie a square lashing. Ah, come on. Uh. Okay, I got one done, but now I just have to do the rest, which is how many points does a 22 line graph have? 11 times 11, probably just a couple. It's done with just a couple connections missing. I'm sure it'll be fine. Now I just gotta get you onto the ceiling and my hooks are too small. So it's a good thing I have a fitness channel. <laughs> Sometimes you no need to solve a problem with smart. Perfect. That's probably good. Sure. Go. This is taking a long time. That's a good sign. Okay. My ceiling has been and hookened. Oh. Okay. It's there. It is on my ceiling. Cool. I'm just gonna do that four more times and hope that it stays. I'm gonna just test it out with one. Oh no. Yeah. It's gonna have to hold a lot more than that. I test it with about half of them. Oh. That's bad. Not, no. I'm getting more hooks. Okay, I think I got it fixed. <sighs> I'm sweating. Who knew that this normal Christmas tradition that everyone does is so taxing? Starting with the big dudes first. <sighs> hmm. Excuse me while I Google how to tie a fishing line. This looks like it's gonna be more long hours of knotting. And my knot is too small. We need something lightweight, but like big enough to not go through here that I can tie around. Wait, one of these had expired vitamins in it when I was eating. There we go. Eh. And, haha! <laughs> I knew I kept forgetting to take my calcium for a reason. This is splendid. How's that height look? Oh, okay. One. Great, just a couple more to go again. Oh, I am officially pumped. This will be the top of the tree, and then that's. Oh, these are awesome. The structure at the bottom, and then I just gotta fill in the middle. I'm now over five hours into hanging. I should have just grown a tree, it would have been faster. Ah! This is the last one, and how cute that it looks like a tree by itself. That's it. It's done. Oh, we gotta take a look. Holy crap. I can't believe that worked. What? Seriously, every step of the way I was just like, no. This has to fail. I'm just making a video where I ruin Christmas. The holiday is not ruined, nor is my ceiling kind of. It looks good in 360, well, every angle. I can't believe this. Now I know traditionally you would put lights on a tree, but mine doesn't need that because it glows! Oh, that is tremendous. <laughs> Man, I don't know what's worse, that pun or the fact that I have a floating blacklight reactive Christmas tree. I think this was worth it, even though it took me 3,000 hours. I'm so glad you came over for the full tour. Now please, no one send this to my landlord. And if you liked that, you'll probably like seeing me turn my car into a giant Chia pet. I'll put that down there for you. What is this? Can I take a picture of yeah, this? Yeah, of course. This is insane. <laughs> oh my god, that is real chia. <laughs> <laughs> Can I turn my car into a giant chia pet? Ch -ch 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 -chia. This idea is definitely not s -s -s stupid. This is 